Honda CBR1000 RR45 blade. It's a 2004. It's done 12,000 miles. I'm just showing you some of the bits and pieces in the paperwork here. We've got the spare key. It comes with its owner's manual. Got the registration document which shows it as two former keepers. Registered July 2004. Comes with the service book. Um, supplied by Chambers Motorcycles, Honda dealer. You can see the servicing there. Last service done at 8,000 miles. It's done 12 now. MOT test certificate. That's valid now through to July 2009. Got some paperwork there from Smart Water showing the registration certificate and some spare stickers. Also it's an HPR certificate showing that it's completely clear. And the last thing is it's got the copy of the description condition report which I've done for the bike. Just a couple of things to show you on the bike. Nothing terribly important really but some of the pictures show this panel here looking a bit kind of patchy but what it is it's just WD-40 has been rubbed onto a piece of black plastic and it's kind of left a bit of a mark on there just wants cleaning properly. There's a couple of other sort of marks which you can see around the bike where the WD-40 has sort of been sprayed at it and um, there's one there on the mirror so it just wants cleaning properly. It's not actually patchy in its appearance apart from the WD-40. It was a wet day when I took the picture, unfortunately there's kind of mud on the tyres. Well it wasn't a wet day, it was just that the grass was wet. Um, Apologise for that. I've noticed there's a screw missing from the fairing here. Uh, so that one's replacing. This is just another picture showing that um, WD-40 and the bike just really wants a good clean really. The rear tyre is probably past its best, it's still legal, um, the front tyre is still quite good so you might have to think about changing that next year sometime. Still got the bike's original exhaust on there, although I think looking through the uh, MOT test certificate and earlier on there showed an advisory for allowed exhaust so it's probably had a loud one at some stage in the past. Uh, the, the bike also comes with the original spare seat, so this plastic cover on the top lifts off and then you clip on the the rear seat onto there. This is something I've not seen before, unusual carbon frame protectors. I don't know what brand that is, but uh, there we go. Good luck with the bidding.